After a month of spring practice, the Elon football team finally reached its final scrimmage. We got a chance to sit down with the coaching staff and get their feelings going into the scrimmage and what they can look forward to on the horizon. After a grueling month of spring practice, Coach Swepson and his staff look to enter Road Stadium, having a few final goals to accomplish before the offseason. On offense, we want to be able to control the line of scrimmage. Uh, on defense, uh, we want to penetrate the line of scrimmage. Uh, so we're going to have some individual battles up front. We want to line up, we want to go in the right direction, uh, and, and let the kids make plays as much as we can. From a special team standpoint, I think it's really just about uh, execution. So. You know, for us, uh, it's going to be a lot heavy emphasis on field goal and field goal block. Uh, and so, you, you know, you hope you make them all, but at the same time, you hope that, you know, you, you may get one blocked for your defensive unit. We're really not in it to, to game plan against our offense, as uh, really what we're trying to do is get reps at all the things that we do. You know, we're not trying to beat our defense right now. We're not trying to, you know, this scheme or that scheme. We're really just trying to evaluate our personnel and let them go out there and play. And our main goal right now is to find a quarterback. You know, we, we lost a, a four-year starter at quarterback, and that being the most important position that we got. Um, you know, all three guys have done a great job here in the spring trying to learn our system. We're going to stick to the basics uh, to see if these kids can play football. It's all about getting better. It's still an evaluation for us. So from the first group of guys to the second group of guys to, to the last guy on the bench, you know, everybody's going to play in the spring game. Hopefully everybody has a little bit of success. You know, I think that all three phases of the game can uh, go out there and, and have a good day. And uh, you know, I'm sure there'll be uh, some highs and lows, both offensively, defensively, and you know, on special teams. But uh, hopefully, in the end, you look back and say, "Hey, that was a really good day. You know, we got better." And uh, you know, hopefully, we'll be able to carry that into the fall. Well, I think you're going to see a lot of energy. Yeah, you know, uh, sometimes uh, the grind of practice is uh, guys are just trying to get through practice and and the energy is, is, is not there. Yeah, it's been really good. The guys have done a good job at uh, you know, doing what they need to do with practice and now with the spring game just around the corner, uh, you know, we're hoping that that will pay off. So I still want it to, have a, to be a work day uh, and, and get good film uh, and see good technique and be able to coach off the film. Spring ball for us is all about technique. We need to get ourselves on video as much as we possibly can. One of the things that you find is uh, some young men are, are better visual learners than they are uh, drawing X's and O's on a chalkboard. You know, we're throwing the entire playbook at them. It's not like we're holding anything back. Hey, we have to uh, continue to teach our guys from now till the spring or to the fall. It can't be brand new again when we start up in the fall. Uh, but at the end of the day, if they got a working knowledge of what we're doing offensively, heading into the summertime, heading into uh, summer camp, getting ready for that first game, uh, then we've completed our goal right there and, and so that they can work in the summer. Though spring practice comes to an end, the coaching staff shifts its focus in a different direction. We'll, we'll be on the road recruiting. Uh, you know, that's, uh, that's important in all college sports is that you have to get out on the road and you got to recruit, you got to find the, the right student athlete. If you have great players, as they say, great players will make you a great coach. Uh, that's going to be successful on and off the football field here at Elon. But as the coaching staff looks to find success this coming season at Elon, they have the pieces in place. An All-American wide receiver, a dynamic and explosive running back, and a fearless defensive leader. But this year, there will be two new faces. Coach Swepson leading the Phoenix and a new quarterback leading the offense.